let's tell you how the Supreme Court today has passed a landmark verdict. The court ruled that a Muslim woman can seek maintenance from her husband under Section 125 of the Code of Criminal Procedure, or the CRPC, which is applicable to all the married women, irrespective of their religion. In fact, a bench of justices, B.V. Nagaratha and Augustine uh, George Massey, have pronounced separate, however concurrent, verdicts on it and has said that Section 125 of the erstwhile CRPC, which deals with a wife's legal right to maintenance, covers Muslim women as well. It in fact covers all married women. The bench has said that maintenance is not charity, but the right of a married woman, and it is applicable to all the married women, irrespective of their religion. In fact, the court, top court has also dismissed the petition of one Muhammad Abdul Samad, who had challenged the order of the Telangana High Court, refusing to interfere with the maintenance order of the family court of 10,000 rupees. In fact, he had contended that a divorced Muslim woman is not entitled to maintenance under Section 125 of the CRPC, and he had invoked the provisions of the Muslim Women Protection of Rights on Divorce Act of 19. 86 for that. So let me go across to Harish. Harish, this is a landmark judgment. You must explain to us the nuances of what this order implies for the future as well. Yes, that's right, Meghna. Landmark uh, judgment as far as the rights of uh, divorced uh, Muslim women is concerned. Supreme Court has said that uh, CRPC section 125 is a secular rule, secular law, which means that it applies to all married women, irrespective of religion, which means that the biggest beneficiary, Meghna, will be Muslim women who had to uh, get recourse to the Muslim personal law and also the uh, Muslim woman, right to divorce woman act, 19 86, which was brought in by the Rajiv Gandhi government, and why did it, why did he bring it under pressure from the conservative Muslim community leaders to circumvent the 1985 Shah Bano judgment of the Supreme Court? That is the significance of this judgment, uh, Meghna. And the Supreme Court has very clearly said that uh, all women uh, uh, can ri claim right to maintenance under CRPC 125. Hitherto, uh, Muslim women could not uh, uh, avail of Section 125, and because uh, the law brought in by Rajiv Gandhi government, which you cited, the Muslim uh, Women's Right Protection of Diverse Women's Act 1986 stood in the way. And, and in fact, the uh, Supreme Court has made very significant observations like Supreme Court highlighted that the time has come for Indian men to recognize the indispensable role and sacrifices made by housewives for the family. The bench highlighted the necessity for husbands to provide financial support to their wives, suggesting practical measures such as maintaining Maintaining joint bank accounts and sharing ATM access to ensure economic stability for women within the household. So very, very scathing observations and as far as the right to women, uh, Muslim women is concerned, made by the Supreme Court. Uh, therefore, and, uh, in fact, this uh, judgment, uh, this judgment essentially means that uh, the uh, today's judgment and also Shabano judgment will prevail and not the law brought in by Rajiv Gandhi government, uh, which is the, uh, which is, uh, in fact, uh, which is the... Uh, which is the Muslim uh, Women Protection of Rights under Divorce Act of 1986. In fact, this is going to be one a big story that we are going to be talking to you. But uh, for the time being, we are just quickly moving on to...